Waipa party leader Kalonzo Musyoka was in Mwatate Taveta to witness outgoing governor John Rutu hand over instruments of power to Waipa's Granton Samboja. He asked the new administration to deliver its promises to residents and also touched on Nasa's petition at the Supreme Court. <laughs> My government will closely scrutinize service delivery and productivity of all our county government officials. In Kilifi County, hundreds of residents, including Hassan Joho of Mombasa, witnessed the swearing in of Governor Amazon Kingi at the Karisa Maifa grounds. The leaders revived the dream of the late coast politician Ronan Gala, that of having a president from the coast region someday. Ama muhula huu, waka mwaka wa 2022, siyasa ya kitaifa na misimamo yetu kitaeleweka. In Tanariva County, Governor Dado Godana of ODM was sworn in at Hola Stadium. Justice Patrick Otieno and Magistrate James Masharia oversaw the exercise. Losers in various seats graced the occasion. Outgoing Governor Hussein Dado, however, skipped the event. Takama weo utandikuwa kazi. Na uje na mtindo ule ule wa kutoenda kazini safiri kilifi na malindi tuko na kalamu ndio sababu nimeibeba ndio sababu nimefanya nini nimeibeba hatutakubembeleza utakula kala utakula kalamu Adekwale Baraza Park Governor Salim Vuria and his deputy Fatma Achani took the oath of office to serve for a second term. Mining cabinet secretary Dan Kazungu and other leaders were in attendance. Vuria promised to double whatever development initiatives he had started in Kwale during his first term in office. Vuria had this message to his opponents, including Chirao Ali Mwakwere of Waipa, who came in second, and Isa Chipera of ODM, who came in third, during the just concluded general election. Kama unawazo zuri, sasa tuko na ile process ya public participation. Weka wazo yako, tuwedele pele. Ngoje siku nyingine, sasa utowe maneno ya siyasa. Hassan Joho is expected to be sworn in on Tuesday in Mombasa. Peter Mongangi, NTV.